The starter motor was donated to me kindly by a motorcycle dealership nearby, where the motor was removed from a motorcycle and diagnosed faulty, incorrectly. In this video, I'll show you how to test and diagnose a starter motor without the possibility of making a diagnostic error and getting it done under one minute. What you need is a removed starter motor, which shouldn't take you more than five minutes because it's typically mounted with only two bolts. Remove starter motor, jumper cable and the battery. Connect the jumper cable to the ground first. There. And uh, my battery is mounted in the vehicle. I'm going to use it as is. Connect the ground at the source. Connect the power at the source. And lastly, turn around here and let's see if this works. I guess it does. Start the motor checks out, diagnosis over.